Patients went before the California Medical Board asking that members of the board support a new patient's Bill of Rights. Those rights include right to transparency, disclosing to the patient if a doctor is on probation before an appointment, right to be notified. This gives patients the right to be interviewed and permission to participate in proceedings if there's a potential case, right to independent arbiters. Consumer watchdogs say this would eliminate any conflicts of interest. Right to timely action, this would speed up proceedings. Right to accountability, this would be an investigation of the board's enforcement activities by the state auditor. And right to proportionate enforcement, like ensuring high priority complaints, including patient deaths, sexual misconduct, or substance abuse, receive full investigations. One California doctor was sentenced today for sexual exploitation and battery. Despite patients filing multiple complaints with the medical board, he wasn't removed until criminal charges were filed. Patients need this information so they can make an informed decision. If I would have had the information about what you hit on the shelves of all the notifications from the other ladies who had, he had sexually assaulted, I would have ch not chose him. California Medical Association has opposed past versions, arguing it would be unfair and overly burdensome on a doctor's time. Dan? All right, thank you very much, Christopher. Meantime, a former Salinas resident who says she was groped after heart surgery by a Salinas Family Memorial Hospital doctor is moving forward with civil litigation. Regina Linares is suing SVMH and Dr. Robert Ladarchak. The case is scheduled to go to trial in September. Dr. Ladarchuk has also been charged with misdemeanor sexual battery by the Monterey County District Attorney. He is scheduled to be back in court May 25th.